Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are talking about something that a lot of students ask about proxy sites for school Chromebooks. But before we dive in, I need to give you some really important information first. So here's the truth, I'm not going to give you a list of proxy links, and here's why. Using proxies to bypass your school's internet filters actually violates your school's acceptable use policy. This can lead to serious consequences like losing your Chromebook privileges, detention, or even suspension. Your school's IT team can see when you try to access blocked sites, even through proxies. Plus, many proxy sites are actually dangerous. They can steal your passwords, install malware, or expose your personal data to hackers. Instead of risking your academic record and online safety, here's what you should actually do. If you need to access a website for legitimate schoolwork, talk to your teacher or IT department. They can often whitelist sites that are educational. Use your school's resources properly during school hours. That's what they're there for. If you want to browse freely, use your own device on your own data or internet at home. Remember, those internet filters exist to keep you safe and help you focus on learning. I know this isn't the video you expected, but I'd rather give you honest advice than help you get in trouble. Your education and online safety are way more important than accessing blocked websites. If you found this helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more honest tech content. Drop a comment if you have questions about using technology responsibly at school. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.